Welcome to pregame. Today we are discussing episode 117 of Dragon Ball Super. Guys, this is a series that I wanted to start on my channel for a while, where I take everything we know about an upcoming episode, package it nicely together, and present it in a video for you guys. And because this is the flagship video of this series, I really want some feedback from you guys if you enjoyed it. Hit a thumbs up. If you disliked it, hit the thumbs down. If this video can hit 150 likes, then you can expect another pregame next Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern on this channel. Before we go any further, what's up, guys? My name is Dooley, and today we are pregaming for episode 117 of Dragon Ball Super titled Showdown of Love Androids vs. Universe 2. Be sure to follow this channel on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Those links are all in the description. Also, subscribe for tons of Dragon Ball Super content. That's it. Let's jump into this pregame. So episode 117 of Dragon Ball Super will likely start with a weakened Goku being attacked by Ribrian and Rosie. Again, Goku is pretty much out of power, out of stamina from using Ultra Instinct to defeat Kefla in last week's episode. And Rosie and Ribrian are going to try and capitalize on that and knock Goku off of the platform. I think there's a good chance we might actually see Goku get smacked around a little bit, but then at some point, Androids 18 and 17 are going to join the fight to protect Goku. This encounter is going to split into two fights. We're gonna see Android 18 versus Ribrian and Android 17 versus Rosie. Android 18 is going to prove to be more than a match for Ribrian, surprisingly enough. She is going to be holding her own and it's going to be enough to force Ribrian into a new transformation, something that we've never seen before. Now, at some point in her fight with Android 18, Ribrian is going to revert back to her base form which we haven't seen since the start of the tournament and as of right now we just aren't sure if that's because she's taken so much damage from Android 18 that she just sort of loses power or if she has to go back to her base form to power up into her new transformation. Ribrian still has some tricks up her sleeve. She is going to manage to trap Android 18 in one of her little key love blasts. It might only be for a short time, but that is going to happen at some point in the episode. Although we are getting to see a brand new power from Ribrian this episode, I think that there's a good chance that this may be a last stand for her and we may end up seeing her eliminated in this episode. Now that's just speculation, those are my personal thoughts, but if we do, it's gonna have huge implications for next week and I'll talk a little bit more about that before the end of this video. Now back to Goku, after being saved by the androids, Goku is going to be attacked by more members of Universe 2. They are Zarbuto, Zerloin, and Robanra. Now since this is a coordinated attack and it's coming right after their fellow Universe mates, Ribrian and Rosie, it's likely that these guys may have had some sort of communication between themselves, deciding that they wanted to go after Goku together at some point earlier in this episode. These guys, for the most part, are fodder characters, but because Goku is in a weakened state, it's likely that they're going to be giving him a hard time. They're going to be getting some good shots off on Goku. At some point while fighting these characters, it's going to be obvious that Goku needs help, and it's likely that the person who is going to come to his aid is going to be none other than Frieza. Once again, we will probably see Frieza helping Goku in the Tournament of Power. Now guys, this may happen closer to the end of the episode, but it will happen. Frieza is gonna take a particular interest in Zarbuto, which is that guy with the mustache. And in case you're wondering, Frieza is much stronger than this guy. So he's going to be doing all sorts of terrible things to this guy. Over to Android 17 versus Rosie. Rosie is going to be doing surprisingly well against Android 17, but at some point it's going to be made clear as day that Android 17 is stronger than she is. She may also get eliminated this episode, but that's not yet clear, although it is a possibility. So let's just take note that both Rosie and Ribrian stand a good chance of being eliminated in episode 117 of Dragon Ball Super. Guys, at some point in the episode, we are likely to get an update on Gohan and Piccolo versus Purina and Sayonel. Those are the two Namikians from Universe 6. Again, these Namikians are going to be putting up a better fight than you probably expected. These Namikians are stronger than the Namikians from Universe 7. Piccolo is actually going to be impressed by their power. And also guys, at some point in the episode, we are going to touch base with Vegeta 
Vegeta is going to try and use Ultra Instinct for himself. He's going to try and copy what Goku is doing. However, every time we've seen Goku use Ultra Instinct, it's been out of need. He's been in a situation where he had no other choice. I think because Vegeta isn't in any mortal danger at the moment because he doesn't have that need at the moment. His initial attempts at going Ultra Instinct will fail and then he is going to be attacked by Kato Pesla. Now I mentioned earlier in the video that Ribrian may get eliminated this episode. And if she does guys, it means that the next universe to be eliminated from this tournament will be universe 2. If Ribrian doesn't get eliminated this episode, or it's made obvious that she is going to get eliminated early next episode, then Universe 2 is fine, Universe 2 is safe. Either way, that's all I got for you guys. If any of you guys have information you'll want to share about 117 of Dragon Ball Super, leave it in the comments below. Let me know if you guys enjoyed the first episode of pregame here on my channel. If you did, please thumbs up this video. Again, 150 likes and you will be seeing another video next Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern. In general, thank you guys for all the support you've been giving my other videos. Thank you to the Notification Squad. Thank you to Do Crew, hashtag Do Crew. I'm excited about episode 117 tomorrow, especially to see how they handle Vegeta's attempt at Ultra Instinct. I will definitely be reviewing that tomorrow night, so look forward to that. Thank you guys once more, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.